heartwarming to see. Mm -hmm. Hope you're all having a great afternoon and what a fantastic yeah. Friday. Yeah. yeah, I think we coordinated when we wore blue suits we today. Did. Yeah, how about that? Yeah, <laughs> and well. Jeffrey's got some blue on too over there. Yeah. Well, we're happy because it's Friday, right? Yeah. That we love. Yes, and it's a warm Friday too, but if you want it cool, you folks down in Lincoln City, the fog and low clouds hung along the coastline most of the day, hugging the coastline. Temperatures there just in the 50s, but a few miles inland, there's a look from our Skamania Lodge camera east up the Columbia River Gorge. A beautiful evening taking shape. I think this might be the last one for some time to come, or at least over the next seven days. Live back here in downtown Portland as we look across northeast Portland. 85 degrees now, dew point 47, north wind at three miles per hour. Our sunrise this morning was at 7.05, and our sunset tonight just four minutes before seven. Boy, some nice temperatures here. Tiger, look at that, 88, Beaverton 86, Hillsboro 85 over on the west side or the east side of the metro area, Washougal 81, Troutdale 80. Camas 81 and Battleground, a toasty 86 right now. It's going to be slow to cool down again tonight as dew points are relatively high, so there's some moisture in the air. But over in eastern and central Oregon, I expect another cool night over there with dew points down into the 20s. That'll help things to cool down. Morning lows this morning, again, warm here in the metro area, 53 in Portland, 50 in Vancouver, but out on the outskirts. Mostly in the 40s. There's those daytime highs. Now, average for this time of the year, 72. So we were a good 13, 14 degrees above normal temperatures in the mid 80s, up and down the I 5 corridor. On the northern Oregon coast this morning, we had early sunshine before the fog rolled in, and Newport again foggy. Now, fog and low clouds are beginning to creep up the coastline, and I uh, anticipate that'll uh, continue this evening. There's that upper level low that we've been watching the last couple of days. It's now starting to make a slow move north and east. It'll come up through the Willamette Valley tomorrow afternoon, introduce a few scattered showers tomorrow night in the southern end of the valley, but I think most of the showers move north in the Portland area overnight tomorrow night while you're sleeping, and then Sunday looks like it will be a shower. Showery day with cooler. Okay, our weather headlines cooling down this weekend. We already know that's coming. Showers return on Sunday and more like October with cooler weather next week and a chance of showers. Our weather pattern shows that ridge of high pressure that we've had up over us is beginning to break down. There's that system right there on Saturday. It lifts north up into Canada on Sunday and Monday. Another trough swings by on Tuesday. And then later in the week, I think we've got another ridge that's going to build. But until then, I think we've got a few scattered showers coming up this weekend, but not a big washout by any means. Let's stop it right here at 530 tomorrow afternoon on Saturday. A few showers now beginning to develop in the valley. This might be a little bit overdone. I think they actually hold off until after dark tomorrow night. And then a whole system lifts north on Sunday and into Monday. Our rainfall forecast will stop it at 4 o'clock on Saturday. Not much yet in the valley, but then overnight Saturday night into Sunday. That's when I think we pick up our measurable rainfall. Again, not a whole lot. Okay, coastal forecast tomorrow and your Saturday. Clouding up evening showers. Those fog and morning low clouds will pretty much hang on the coast most of the day. Temperatures in the mid 60s tomorrow there. In the valley on your Saturday, clouds increase in the afternoon. I think it's going to start out mostly sunny. It'll be a nice morning. Temperatures will top out in the lower 70s, so we'll knock a good 13, 14 degrees off where we were today. Central and east side of the state, mostly sunny. Clouds increase late over there as well. Southwest wind 5 to 10 miles per hour. We'll back those temperatures off by a good 10 to 15 degrees. In the gorge in the mountains on your Saturday, mostly sunny in the morning, but those showers do increase late. Bonneville Dam about 73, and the Dalles. He's a warm spot there at 76. Jump right in that seven day forecast. One more drive day, I think, tomorrow. And then we've got the evening showers coming in. Look at that. We back it off quite a bit there. A good 10, 12 degrees. And then shower chances stick around on Monday, or excuse me, Sunday and Monday. Then mostly dry next week with a few passing showers about where we should be yeah, for early just October. Just a little cooler. Yep. I, I haven't. I don't even know what day it is, I feel like, but I think this weather is kind of screwing with me. I can't believe it's going to be October. Yeah, already. Jeez. Monday, October 1st. Yep, biggest month of change in Portland. We averaged 71 for the high on the 1st and only 58 on the last day of the month. Yeah, 20 degrees wow. difference. Yeah, big change yeah. there. Right. Thanks, well, Steve. still to come, Facebook says,